So this is uh, Nuvation's uh, energy storage container. Uh, it's going to be able to supply two megawatts of power to a waste treatment facility in Santa Rosa, California. This is going to be able to power their generators before they are able to power up fully. So in the event of a power outage, they're going to be able to quickly turn on the container to instantly provide the lost power while the generators turn on and then take over the power load. This is a very specialized power delivery system. It delivers uh, up two megawatts in approximately 15 minutes, and it has a very small footprint. This type of project has a lot of batteries. That's kind of the heart of the, of the container. And so every battery needs to be maintained with uh, voltage characteristics, uh, current limits, um, temperature, all these different factors. And so having a battery management system is what really controls that and ensures that the system is operated safely and is a key part in ensuring the operation of it. Okay, so here we have one of our battery racks. So if we take a look inside, it's filled with uh, Enerdel battery modules. That's what we have here. You can open one of these up and you can see the battery modules. So for every stack, there are two stacks in one rack. So every stack is composed of 21 of these battery modules. If we take a closer look at one of them, We've actually integrated our, one of our battery management systems, our cell interface, onto each battery module. And then we have this uh, transition board that interfaces between the two. Um, and then these will all be connected and feed into the other battery management products that we have inside of the stock switch gear. And this is like the interface between the batteries and the DC bus. And this allows us to do all the controls. Uh, it allows us to measure current, voltage, and control contactors, as well as some other safety features that we've integrated into it. Uh, so we're watching for uh, container safety for the people. Is this with e-stop system? Uh, we're monitoring the temperature of the container itself. So we control HVAC system for uh, fans to can flow uh, air through the container to keep um, uh, the, the, the operation of the container safe. We have a fire suppression system. I'm really looking forward to watching the power, which is you know, watching it, watching electricity, uh, watching the whole thing work at the end. That's going to be what I think is our final reward. My favorite part of the project, probably seeing things come to life. So from the design stage to actually seeing them. So whenever we receive uh, fabricated parts or new components that are in, it, it's always great to see them in real life and, and know that we actually designed that and we had a part in making that thing come to life.